America makes up for around about 18% of the world's chocolate consumption. And right here on Pine Avenue in Long Beach, we have a very, very special treat for you here at Romeo's Chocolate. Not only is there some special divine chocolate in here, especially for Valentine's Day coming up, but you also have wine pairing and chocolate workshops for the little ones. We're going to talk to the founder of Romeo to see what he has created right here. I'm here with the man himself, the creator of Romeo's Chocolate. What an incredible space here you have. Not only chocolates though, as everybody might think, so tell us about it. Well, first of all, welcome. So glad that you're here in our uh, chocolate shop. In addition to serving chocolates, uh, we're so excited to also share what we love to do in terms of beer, wine, coffee, and tea, and really create a space for folks to linger, relax, and hang out. That's ultimately our goal. As soon as you walk into the space, smelt that coffee, smelt the incredible chocolate. You have so many different kinds. It is gorgeously set up. You can lounge in the back. You've got couples doing the wine tasting, families playing games, and not just the space itself, you also create workshops. Tell us a little bit about that. Our goal is to create opportunities for people to have a really great experience around chocolate. That could either be a chocolate making workshop for kids, where they make their own chocolate bars. We do chocolate and wine pairing parties as well too. Uh, we do chocolate bar making workshops, chocolate truffle making workshops. But ultimately what we encourage folks too is just to come in and you know do a flight of wine if they'd like, get a cup of coffee, and also try like a flight of chocolates if they prefer. So our chocolates are inspired by world travel. And so when I first started chocolates, we went to Belgium to really look at the technique that was happening with European style truffles. And so we do that in that similar type of style, but our goal is really to bring in single origin chocolates. So we're bringing in chocolates from Ecuador, Honduras, Nicaragua, uh, Philippines, my heritage islands, and Hawaii. And so we source those chocolates looking for origin, similar to how you're sourcing wine from different terroir, uh, but also we're looking for flavor profiles as well too. We love when kids come in here and we're able to share how to make their very own chocolates and not just for them to try it, but to know where chocolates come from. So we even have baby cacao trees here in our shop so that way young people are more connected with their food as well too. The beautiful part about Long Beach is there's a lot of synergy among all the artisans, chefs and small makers. So for instance in our charcuterie board you're going to see honey that's locally harvested here from beehives uh, around downtown Long Beach and the surrounding area. We have uh, habanero marmalade from a local artisan. Our bread is baked just a block away at at St. and Center's Bake Shop, so there's a lot of synergy happening with small businesses. And likewise, we're happy to see that our chocolates are showing up in different cafes and coffee shops around here too. What kind of events have you got coming up and um, how can people also come on over and say if they can't come on over, can they buy the things online too? Right now, we're setting up for a really amazing and fun Valentine's season. So you're going to see a lot of heart-shaped boxes, a lot of heart-shaped truffles here. People are gifting their significant other and we like to play our role in being Cupid in that and making sure that we're Helping that gifting experience. So you're going to see a lot of chocolate and wine pairing parties in terms of events. Uh, you're going to see our chocolate making workshops for kids so that way they can make chocolates for their parents if they like as well too. Now if people don't have an opportunity to come to our downtown shop they can shop online. So if they visit our website they could see our different types of creations on there and they could book their experiences on our website too. Amazing, and they'll know all about the dates and workshops on your website as well. Plug that in, where's your website? So our website is going to be RomeoChocolates.com and then they can book their experiences there and buy their gift boxes there too. And the timings that you're open to the local people and everybody around? So generally our shop is open from 12 p.m. onwards and so especially for Valentine's season we're open every day. And so from 12 p.m. to 9 p.m., Fridays and Saturdays, we open later because we have our dessert crowd that comes in after, uh, after the restaurants, after they have dinner. So we're open a little later to 11. Well, thank you so much thank for having you. us here. This Pleasure. is such an incredible Thanks. space. Yummy as well. Thank you. As you've seen and heard, Romeo's Chocolate has so much more to offer than just chocolate. And look at this divine selection over here. We got fresh bananas, strawberries from the farmer's market. I cannot wait to dive in here. So why don't you come on over for a special Valentine's treat or a night out? Mm. Yum, yum. For more local news stories and happenings here in Long Beach, head on over to longbeachlocalnews.com. I'm Yasmin Tamras.